beneath the intense spotlight of the Phuket World Cup, the 102kg weight class becomes a coliseum of ambition and iron will. Turokti Media Irakli Chaide, the Georgian powerhouse, seeks to outdo himself. Gadi Karapetyan's youth burns bright, but can it eliminate a pass to the podium? How will Lesman Paredes perform after injury? Is there a chance for Armenia's Samvel Gasparian hopes for a place in the Olympic team? Does the Chinese prodigy Lu Huanhua have the title force for more kilos in the bar? And Meso, the Qatari legend, does he have more peaks to conquer? The ear is ripe with questions, and only the clash of weight and will can answer them. As the 102 kilo weight class gears up for an epic Thailand showdown, we invite you to be part of the excitement. Head over to Torukti Media, hit subscribe, ring the bell, and drop your predictions in the comments. Who will hoist the gold? Who will set new records? Share your thoughts and join the conversation as we witness strength history in the making. We open our review with Rakli Chaidze from Georgia. He has a solid collection of gold in junior worlds and Europeans in 105 and 102 weight classes. Last year at the Europeans in Yerevan, he won silver in total with 173 in snatch and 214 in clean and jerk. Later on at the Worlds in Saudi Arabia, he improved his total with 4 kilos and got 6th place with a solid 175 in snatch and 216 in clean and jerk. At this World Cup, with an entry total of 397 kilos, predictions lean towards a podium finish. The question is, will Chaiza surpass his past best and push beyond the 397 kg entry, or will the competition prove a weight too heavy? Liu Huanhua of China, entering with a total of 395 kilos. His steady climb through weight classes showcases an exceptional adaptability and growth. During the last few years, he competed from 89 to 109 kilos weight classes, and his total moved from 381 kilos to 418. Just imagine! 2022 bronze medal at Worlds in 89 kilo category. 2023 gold medal at Asians in 96 kilogram weight class. Same year, gold medal at Worlds in Riyadh in 102 with 180 kilos in snatch and 224 in clean and jerk. Few months later, gold again at the Asian Games with the 418 kilos total and 185 in snatch and 233 in clean and jerk. And in a month, a silver at the Qatar World Cup with 176 in snatch and 222 kilos in clean and jerk. These few seasons were very intensive for Huanhua. He definitely put in a lot of effort to show his solid total and to secure his spot for Paris 2024. Because, as we know, the selection process for the Chinese Olympic team is tough and unpredictable. You must be strong, stable, resilient, and very lucky. At a youthful 20 years, Gari Karapetyan, hailing from Armenia, is a force in the 102 kilo category, with an entry total of 400 kilograms. Fresh from his last year Europeans triumph in Yerevan, solid bronze this year as well, winning junior worlds right after and setting a bunch of junior world records, expectations are sky high. Will he climb to the medal podium at Phuket with his best of 183 kilograms in snatch and 214 kilos in the clean and jerk? As a promising junior lifter, he also has all chances to secure a spot for Paris participation and maybe for an Olympic medal too. Introducing Mel 2.0.
the competition Olympic weightlifting program. As a two-time Olympian, I have created it for advanced athletes, drawing from my experience to help you reach peak performance. Get ready for 12 weeks of intensive training to set new records in snatch and clean and jerk. I guarantee results or 100% money back. Join Mail 2.0 now and let's chase records together. Lesman Paredes, now lifting for Bahrain, comes to this World Cup with the same entry total of 400 kilograms. The Colombian-born athlete, world champion in 2021 and 2022, boasts a world record in snatch of 187 kilos in 96 weight class. At 27 years old, he has a solid experience competing on the international stage for 15 years, and also he owns a collection of junior and senior medals at Pan Am competitions. After his transition to Bahrain, he won Worlds and Asian Championship with the same total 397 kilos in 96 weight class. After that, we didn't see Lasman lifting for a year and a half due to the injury issues and rehab. So now, in the 102 kilo weight class, he needs a solid total on the Phuket platform to secure his Olympic spot and prove again that he is an elite. Samvel Gasparian from Armenia, with a robust entry total of 400 kilograms, carries both experience and ambition into the Phuket World Cup. Gasparian is 26 years old. He's been competing on international platforms for over 10 years. During this period, he made a lot of successful performances at junior and senior levels. Recently, he competed in both 102 and 109 weight classes. He got bronze at the Worlds in Bogota 2022. Also, he won the Europeans twice in 2022 and 2023. This year, at the Europeans in Sofia, he showed his personal record total 396 kilos with 180 kilos in snatch and 216 in clean and jerk, respectively. His current best snatch of 180 kilos and a clean and jerk of 220 kilos are testaments to his prowess. We suggest that his resilience and strategic approach to the competition will potentially place him in a strong position for at least a bronze. Fares Ibrahim Elbach, known in the weightlifting realm as Meso Hassona, stands out not only for his impressive collection of accolades, but also for his consistent performance over time. Representing Qatar, at 25 years old, Elbach has solidified his status with an Olympic gold in 2021. After his victory in Tokyo, Meso stood on the podium of most major world and Asian championships except Worlds 2023, where he reached only 7th place in total due to his lower back injury a month before the event. Nevertheless, he won silver in clean and jerk with 218 kilograms. And then, just in 3 months, he made a big comeback with victory at the Qatar World Cup with 400 kilograms total and 224 in clean and jerk. Now, with an entry total of 400 kilograms, he plans to show even more. R.I. turns to his personal best total of 404 kilos, achieved at the 2019 Qatar Cup in 96 weight class. Last month, Meso spent in the training camp here in Thailand for the best adaptation for the climate conditions, meaning that he and his team are determined for only one result – victory, here and in Paris as well. So brace yourselves, as we are about to witness the ultimate showdown in the 102 kilos class. A battle where legends rise and records fall. The road to Olympic Paris 2024 begins here, in Phuket. Join us at Torak Team Media as we follow these weightlifters on their quest for Olympic glory. Like, subscribe and share your champion predictions in the comments below. The stage is set, the bar is loaded, let the battle begin. Stay tuned for this journey of champions where we always remember Warm Body, Cold Mind.